Hello, I'm Edward and welcome to WindowsReport.com. In this video I will show you how to unblock Adobe Flash Player on multiple browsers. Flash was one of the most famous web technologies but nowadays it is blocked by default on almost all web browsers in favor of HTML5. Because most of the browsers no longer run Flash by default, we need to unblock Adobe Flash content manually. We will first start with Edge, a browser developed by Microsoft and available by default in your operating system. To do this, we need to switch Edge's Adobe Flash Player settings in the Settings menu. When you open your Edge browser, you will see at the top right corner a Settings and More button. Select Settings and then click View Advanced Settings to open the options below. Then switch the Use Adobe Flash Player setting on. From now on, whenever you have Flash content to load, a dialog box will show asking you to select either Always Allow or Allow Once option. In Google Chrome, a similar process will occur. We will have to configure Flash settings as follows. Press the Customize Google Chrome button to open the browser's menu. Click Settings, scroll to the bottom of the page and click Advanced. Then click Content Settings and select Flash to open the options shown in the snapshot directly below. You can unblock Adobe Flash content by switching block sites from running Flash to Ask first. And then you can also add websites to the Allow list to enable Adobe Flash to always run on them. To do that, just click Add Input a Website URL and press the Add button. Afterwards, when loading Flash content on Chrome, a similar dialog box, as in Edge, will ask you to either allow Flash or block it. And the last option, if you are a Firefox user, you can also proceed to activate your Flash player to do this. Press the Open menu button at the top right of Firefox window. Click Add-ons to open the tab in the shot directly below. Then select Plugins to open the plugin list. Select Always Activate on Flash's drop-down menu. In this case, there should not be any box asking to allow, but if there is a dialog box, simply press Allow. If none of this helped you, make sure you read the full article in the description below. And if it did help you, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.